A church community in Morristown is excited now to begin building a new sanctuary after a fire destroyed the old one just last year. You remember this? We showed yep. you this video back in March 2020, sent in from Dina Bowling when Road Junction Baptist Church went up in flames. Well, now Builders for Christ, a volunteer-based organization, has agreed to help rebuild. In our top story tonight, WAT6 on your side reporter Kristen Gallant shares what this help means to the pastor and church members. March 29th, 2020 is a date Pastor Jason Lemka will not soon forget. It was 6.30 in the morning. I had actually got a, a phone call from the police department and telling us that the church was on fire. The thought still makes him emotional a year later. I guess this past year for everyone, not just us, uh, but everyone has been unbelievable. Not only did Road Junction Baptist Church lose their main building, but at the same time, COVID-19 happened. It really tests your faith. Church member Jimmy Fullington says it's that faith which keeps him going. Well, I've been going here about all my life, but I, I got saved and was baptized in 1962. It's my home church. I always will be, I reckon. But when his home church was lost in the fire, it brought him back to another loss he had in a mining accident in 1976. Same date, 45 years ago, I lost my right leg on March 29th. And then on the same day, March 29th, we lost our church. So you can imagine what that done to me and, and how I felt because I, I just didn't know, at the time, I didn't know what in the world I was going to do. Fullington hopes March 29th next year can hold a different type of memory. This time next year, we're hoping to have a whole new uh, new sanctuary and, and church built by then. And with the help of the community, the work to rebuild is already being set in motion. April 19th is the day we're supposed to start securing a building permit. Uh, and I think it's September 24th, I think, someday like that, is actually supposed to be the soft movement, soft opening date. An event that most people would see as a loss, this church sees as an opportunity. Just the church had been here for 100 years, and I think people maybe had lost sight of it, and uh, this may be the way God put a light back on it. In Morristown, Kristen Gallant, WATE 6 on your side. Builders for Christ in the church say any help is appreciated and you can volunteer to help out in the building process or make a monetary donation. We're going to have all of that information for you easy to find on our website at WATE.com.